Hey you guys, it's Ryan and Paul from Resale CMY. We're here with our weekend sales video for the 4th of July weekend. We got a really good weekend as far as numbers wise, pretty good weekend as far as dollars. The dollar total for this weekend, what's coming to us is $1,228.31. I think with like shipping and tax and all that stuff, if you look on the computer it says like, it was like $1,750 worth of orders. But this is what comes to us before the fees get taken out. Um, 52 orders. Yeah. Uh, 52 items going out. 51 different people purchased stuff from us. If you guys don't know, uh, we're, we buy this stuff in big collections or at garage sales, yard sales, stuff like that. And then we uh, resell it on eBay exclusively uh, to make a profit. Um, We'll just get right into it here because we got a lot of stuff to go over. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff. I mean, we even got like clothing items behind us and stuff like that. So it's gonna be fun shipping. Yeah, it's gonna take us a while. Um, the first thing here that I'll go over is gonna be this. Uh, we got a album going out the door here. This is a uh, Foreigner Four. 1981 and this is going to be $12 with free shipping on this so it'll go media mail and we'll probably make like eight bucks on it next thing that sold here is this uh low rust quartz alarm clock it's a vintage one a mickey mouse and it was brand new this came from dan's house and this sold at $20 plus shipping next thing here is this uh link power line extender tp link you can see it here it's for uh i don't know something to do with your wi-fi setup try to get it through your whole house probably could have used something like this eventually but it's been sitting around forever and i'm not inclined to figure out how to use it so 16 dollars plus shipping on this and next sale here is uh these despicable me they're minions i uh i home bluetooth speaker we sold a quantity of three of these. I still think we have some more. These all came from Dan's. I think there's two more left. Quantity of three. These went out for $11.22 plus shipping for all three. Yeah, and uh, I'm, we were running a sale. Anything that's been here for like 90 or more days, I think it was 25% off. Yeah. And then 50 to 89 days was 15% uh, off. And then like 30 to 50 days or something like that was 10% off. Uh, we got a Funko Pop going out here. It's this Yoda, number 124. Again, this was one of the items that was on sale. I'm not sure for what amount this one was. It was uh, $6.74 plus shipping. I think this might have been like a 15% off one, but again, I'm not positive. Uh, next thing here is this Hallmark 1987 uh, Kringles Toy Shop Light and Motion Christmas Ornament. And this one sold $8 plus shipping. We got a lot of smaller items going out the door, but just uh, stay tuned. We got some bigger stuff here as well. Another small thing, though, is this uh, complete collection of wallet calendars. It's Elvis, RCA Records. And this is just a little bonus thing that was in a tote that came from Dan's. We looked it up and it sold a little bit. Sold on sale, $5.94 plus shipping on this little thing. And next thing that sold here, this came from Dan's also. We have two of them. One's a ladies. This is the men's. Um, these are Harlem Globetrotter jerseys. This one is, I should say. This is size 2XL. It's by FUBU. This sold at $13 plus shipping. This came from Dan's. Be nice to get some of the stuff off the table that's in front of yeah. us there. I feel like a claustrophobic right now. All right, from the $1,150 game buy, we have these uh, DK bongos for Donkey Kong. Um, it's been opened, but if you opened it up, the bongos have never been used. Uh, the cords were wrapped all professionally and stuff like that. Took pictures of it, took pictures of the contents, sold it as new open box. $18 plus shipping on this. So put it over there. Another one of these Kringle toy shops. Uh, same ornament I just showed you. This one sold actually at $4 on offer plus shipping. Yeah, we don't discriminate when it comes to price. Same ornament, $4 difference. Just send us offers if there's stuff you're interested in. <laughs> the main focus is get it out the door and make a little bit of money. 
Uh, again, from the $1,150 game buy. You got this PlayStation 2 multi-tap. It's, uh, you can play four players on it. It has four different memory card slots as well. Uh, so for $16 plus shipping. Next thing here is this Wings International Cat Doll. This thing's pretty big. This came from our doll buy down in uh, Ithaca. This thing's been listed for a while. This sold that offer, $10 plus shipping. I'm glad that thing's going yeah. off the door. Another item that came from Dan's here. You've probably seen us sell some of these vinyl banks before. I think we got another one going out as well. This one is the Black Panther. It is not one of the Diamond Select ones, so it didn't have as much value. But it's a seven inch bust. Uh, vinyl bank has a slot on his back sold on sale for $11.89 plus shipping Next thing we have here is this uh, looks like a poker chip, but it's got Chris Paul on it This came from Marty's from New Orleans Hornets back then this little poker chip sold nine dollars free shipping Yeah, we got a Yadro ornament here. This is the rocking horse 6262. Um, sold this a couple times already. This one sold on sale for $26.24. This came from Dan's as well with quantity. This next thing you see here is a Mr. Bumble chalkware head. Um, Boston chalkware from England. And this one was in red. I've never seen one in red on there. I actually up priced this from the blue ones. And this sold at full price $20 plus shipping. Got a Star Trek ornament going out the door. It was $24 originally. Brand new in the package there. So for $10 plus shipping. Quite a few ornaments going out the door this weekend. That's cool. Next thing here is this 1992 complete set of upper deck baseball cards. The collector's choice. These sold on sale $7.50 plus shipping. It's been a while since we sold yeah. our thing of cards. All right, from that game buy, um, $1,150 game buy, there was a lot of Nintendo DS cases and uh, 3DS cases, and none of them had the games in them, but we still grabbed them anyway. Uh, yeah, Kennedy's gonna try to sneak in behind me. Say hi. Hi. But I grabbed all the cases anyway, knowing some might have some value, and right off the get-go, we got Metroid Prime Pinball. Just the case. Just the case. Thirty dollar case manual and inserts. Thirty dollars free shipping on this. So we're gonna make twenty five dollars off the case. And the next one is gonna be the heaviest hitter of the weekend. Um, this is gonna be a Yadro statue. As you guys can see, it's pretty large here. This one's name is Solitude and number two two five six M. This sold three hundred dollars plus shipping. We gotta be very careful shipping that yeah. that dove that's on it and stuff like that. We'll take our time yeah, with it. Double box it probably. Yeah, definitely. Um, next here we got some U.S. Army trousers, cold weather can the that said div digital camo. It's an excellent, excellent condition. Um, Pick this up at a garage sale for three bucks. Um, it's one of our live garage sale footage videos. Yep. We also found a helmet there that sold for like $280, but this sold for $55.24, so really good for a $3 purchase. And the next thing we have here is this Gund Classic. It's a Pooh Eeyore Disney Gray Plush, and this thing sold for $9 plus shipping. Where'd this come from, Kathy's? I put it down as Kathy's, yeah, I think but I'm not positive. Kathy's. I thought it was in very Probably good. Came, I think it came with all the Boyd's Bears yeah. things. All right, we got a golf head uh, going out the door, head only. This uh, TaylorMade R580 driver, nine and a half degree. Um, it's good condition. I picked this up at a garage sale. Just coming back home from the the VA, uh, stopped at one place, spent thirty bucks, and we've done really well at yeah, it. I think this, you sold all of it. Yeah, this wasn't the the greatest pickup, but they were uh, two dollars and sold for fifteen dollars free shipping so we'll probably make like seven eight bucks on we sold it. both of them the same price though so. yeah and and uh they both this one took like a week the other one took like two three days mm -hmm. so not too bad next thing we have here is this uh beauty and the beast it's a 1994 mrs potts it's a teapot cookie jar 
This came from Dan's. This is the second one we've sold. This one sold on offer, $25 plus shipping. I think we have one more buried somewhere, so we're going to have to uncover it. Okay, we got Mario Kart for the Nintendo GameCube. This came from the $1,150 game buy as well. This sold for $30 of free shipping. It has no manual, and I wrote untested. It has lots of scratches on the back. Um, doesn't look like any of them are too deep or anything, but I said sold as is. Had this listed as 40, someone offered 30, and uh, we picked, I jumped on that right away, get it out the yeah. door. And the next sale we have here is not a big hitter, but it's 1991 Bing and Grandal, Copenhagen, Santa Claus collector's plate. This thing sold $4.50 on offer plus shipping. Pretty sure that came from Dan. It right? did. It did. Yeah. This come from the action figure by last year. Yep. Okay. I wrote it down as that. Mm -hmm. uh, it's got like a cheaper Star Wars one here, Episode One. It's one of these flashback photo deals here. This sold on sale for three dollars and seventy four cents plus shipping. I make a couple bucks still on it. Um, the next thing sold here is a Swarovski Silver Crystal. This is the nineteen eighty eight passenger car train number 7471 and this thing sold on sale two dollars and or twenty dollars and forty cents plus shipping all right actually tested something out here for the eleven $1 hundred fifty dollar buy getting this out the door this is game boy advance right here and it came with four games uh some games that were cheaper that i couldn't sell on their own hamster life 2 Shrek, Madagascar, and then Shrek 2. So, a lot of four games. Also had this case, tested out good, played well. $65 plus shipping on this one. So that's a really good one yeah. to get out the door. And I have another one just like this, so I gotta test it. Nice. Um, another thing that sold here is a Superman, Batman, Dark Knight Returns, DRK figure, Direct Loose. This is a Superman figure. This came from the action figure buy. This thing sold $9 on offer, plus shipping. Superman, Batman, The Dark Knight yeah. Returns. I read it just the way it was. Daddy, let me find you. Well, that's weird. DR, DKR figure, DC Direct Loose. Uh, I don't know if that's titled right. But no, but it sold. That's odd. Uh, that's probably why someone bought it. Like, what? This yeah. must be super rare. Superman with Batman? Um, little I know there's probably like tons of yeah I mean we said exactly how it's supposed to be <laughs> yeah no, I have no idea all right another ornament going out the door five dollars for this one it's a deer crossing um I don't know how many ornaments we listed but it's good to see every single one yeah, get out I'm door. happy when they all go out the door another five bucks and the next thing here is this is it a game right here no. no this is a part of that. This is Joe and Mac Lost, Joe and Mac 2, Lost in Tropic Super Nintendo. This is the authentic SEN, SNES manual. Just this manual alone, $55 free shipping. Make sure, that, make sure that doesn't get bent up yep. in there. All right, we got one of these uh, Pizza Hut. The Pizza Hut, right? Yep, Pizza Hut. Pizza Hut Land Before Time hand puppet here. This is Sarah. The three horn, seventeen dollars with free shipping on this since it's, it's super light. Um, we'll clear like thirteen bucks on. And the good 12, thing about those bucks. is we have. I know <clears throat> we have more stash away in some bins. Yeah, they, we only had one little foot, and we have a Fives quantity here. of of five of these. I think six of the petri, yeah. which you'll see here in a little bit as well. Um, yeah. So I hope, hopefully Dan has more. We can just keep picking them up. I got that Waterford. This? Yeah. Oh, okay. I'll let you do the two Ladros because we're the same guy bought them together. Mm -hmm. Different prices, too. Yeah. This next thing that sold here is this Marquee by Waterford. It's a nine inch bowl, crystal bowl. This came from Dan's house and this sold on sale $16.14 plus shipping. All right, we bought a bunch of these Yadro tree toppers from Dan's. All the boxes are different, and they have like uh, different wear and stuff like that. Someone ended up coming around and uh, picking up both of these. We had a quantity. Careful, you all right? 
should try not to face the headbutt my knee. <laughs> you okay? Okay. Just be careful. We ended up selling two of these. Same buyer came along. Uh, they're both Angel. Quiet, huh? Quiet. Kenny, we're trying to talk. Angel uh, Plain of Heart Tree Toppers. Uh, $35 for one. And then they came back later. It must have been on an offer. And yeah. then they came back later and bought the other one for $38.24. So this is the only uh, multiple buy we yep. had this weekend. So these will have to get lotted up, or shipped out together. And the next thing we sold here is this Masters of the Universe Retro Play. These are the newer ones. This is Evelyn. And this sold at $9 plus shipping. And this came from the Lego buy, actually, up in Camden. We got a figure for Marty's here, wrestling. One of these uh, LJN figures, 1984 Hulk Hogan. This sold for $7.50 plus shipping. All right, this next thing we have here is another movie. You've seen these a ton of times if you follow along with us. This is Finding Nemo. This sold $8.50 free shipping. All right, we have the Black Panther Bank going out the door. Now we have this uh, R4G9, whatever that is. <laughs> it's one of the Star Wars figures, kind of like the R2-D2 character. Um, I think I've seen one Star Wars, and I mentioned it in a video before. Yeah, and it was I've two never seen it. And it was too be continued. It was annoying. I saw it in Airborne School. Oh, nice. I was bored. I basically watched every movie in the movie theater. That's the only reason I've been able to stick to the Star Wars, but... I'm glad people like it because we sold this for $32.50 plus shipping. Probably not a smart uh, YouTube move to... to Say you don't like Star yeah, Wars. Yeah. <laughs> Probably doesn't do us any favor. Well, next thing we sold here is a PS3 game. This that is, is a good one. Harry Potter and the Half Blood Prince. And this sold $38 free shipping. Yeah, that was a good one. Got another geeky tiki mug going out the door. I think these are actually, I think this is the last one of this is size. Oh, yeah. Okay. We sold like a Popeye one, a Star Trek one. I remember when we first got those. The first yeah, time Jawa we or dance. something. $7 plus shipping on this. It's just a ceramic mug, geeky tiki. And the next thing that sold here is this $1 bill. This is a. Uh... It's a silver certificate, 1935. It's missing and got we trust on it. And this sold at $5, free shipping. And we'll just put that in an envelope and throw a stamp on it, and that's yeah. how that gets sent out. Now we got a 1990 keepsake ornament from Hallmark. Another mm -hmm. ornament going out the door. This is uh, Children's Express, artist's favorites. $12 plus shipping on You know what's kind of odd about these ornaments? They've been listed for a bit. We've sold one or two, and then this weekend, a holiday weekend, we sell a bunch of ornaments. Yeah, 4th of July. We're past the halfway mark in the year, so people must be focusing on Christmas Those already. Those Kool-Aid things for me. And the next thing that's sold here, these are pretty cool. These are vintage. I mean, I can just tell by the packaging on them. They have uh, 46 cents written on the back. That's how much they were paid for on sale. They're Kool-Aid magnets from Dan's. These sold at $17 plus shipping. And those magnets, we have, I think, three more just like that. And then we have one that's missing one. So whoever the last buyer is of the magnets, I'm going to toss in the Excellent. extra two just to get rid of them. All right, we got a Sigmund Freud bobblehead here. I think we have another one of these too, right? Yeah, somewhere. I cleaned that one up good too. Yep, this one here. This is actually going global shipping. <clears throat> Excuse me. $19.54 plus shipping on this. And as, as you sh uh, Ryan showed you earlier, earlier, Sarah from the Land Before Time Pizza Hut uh, hand figures. This is Petrie. And Petrie sold at $17 free shipping. And the next thing here came from the $1,150 buy. This is one of those, you can see in the screenshot, I got a pre box ready to ship here. Um, this is one of those uh, original Nintendo like control stations or what is it called? Yeah, uh, game, uh, game game center. center system. So it's like you can put the it has a spot for the games, the controllers, and the system itself. So it kind of keeps it organized under your TV. Uh, just listed it. Tried to be cheaper than everybody else. Not too Big, many of them sold. Here. $15 plus shipping on that and get some size out the door. It's pretty cool. You guys seen sold. the video game haul. You've seen that in there too. You, you see exactly what it is. 
And the next thing that sold here from Dan's, it's another watch. This is a Star Trek. Uh, this is a limited edition Fossils watch. This sold $70 plus shipping. Yeah, and we got new batteries put in yep. every single watch. Pretty much every single watch. We These sold. are two cool sales back to back. And I I talked to Paul briefly yesterday, uh, game planning, and I was like, Man, it'd be cool if we sold some watches. And yep. I was kind of talking about like the hundred and fifty dollar, two hundred dollar ones that we have. But right after that, we sold the two only, watches. only two watches of the weekend. The next one here is this Batman one, uh, nineteen ninety four. It says on the back side, and it has like a flashlight in there. It's a whistle flashlight. A whistle flashlight. Um, and then the watch itself. Again, this had the battery put in it. So we have, not only did we buy them, which I don't know how much we have into them. Pennies. We had pennies or a buck or something like that. Something really low just because we bought so much stuff. But, uh, and then like another five, I'd say, for the battery. But yeah, $70 plus shipping on this one as well. So $140. So all these watches, watches you see, we like automatically that. have $5 in for the battery. And sometimes 6 $7 if they needed to be cleaned also. Yeah. So there you go with watches. So we might have paid a less for them we don't know how much because it came with a ton of stuff from dan's i mean trailers full so we can't put a dollar figure on each thing but each each of these have five to seven dollars our money right in them just to sell with to make sure they're working for one because we've had some not work yeah that she's had there so we wouldn't want to sell and one they're brand new work. too yeah and some of them still didn't work so so that, that's on the watches we have five to seven dollars in each one before you even see us list it and uh the next thing that's sold here is this harry potter and the prisoner of as Az Zach Az Caban. Caban. This is for the GameCube. This sold fifteen dollars. Free shipping. We're really up to on our on our uh, Harry Potter as well. Yeah, I've never seen it. Yeah, we're not big into the uh I don't watch movies, man. Ever. No. Like especially a series. Spyro, Season of Flame, Spyro two for the Game Boy Advance. I think there's only two more Game Boy Advance games. This is the last sale. Nine dollars free shipping on an offer. So we'll make like five bucks on this game. Um, yeah, that's it for the sales. Not a bad uh, three-day weekend. It was a long weekend, yeah. but we got some size out of here. We got a lot of shipping to do, but... We average like 300 and change a day. That's perfect. Yeah, that's not, you know... We didn't list all those days. We didn't, I didn't come over here. We did, I did I family did. stuff the whole entire time. I listed. I work. Paul does nothing. Yeah. It's, it's not like he doesn't have stuff to list either. I have some stuff. <laughs> <laughs> all right, uh... Yeah, that's it for this video. We'll have Kennedy end it for us. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Yeah, you guys. Anything else? No, that's it. Uh, yeah. Tell your friends about us. Get us to like and subscribe if you can. And uh, we'll show you. Tell us what you guys want to see. You want to see these sales videos. You want to see listing videos, shipping videos. We can make anything. I mean, this is what we do all day, every day. So if whatever you guys want to see, let us know in the comments. And uh, we'll be sure to film that for you and make a video. All right, guys. Bye. See ya. Say resell CNY. Resell CNY. Said, please like and subscribe. Please like and subscribe. <laughs> Say thank you. Thank you. And bye. Bye. Bye, guys. Right. Thank you. Bye.